Cassie, welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing a review slash demo on this Morphe palette. It's the 15H Happy Hour palette. And um, if you would like to see me do a eyeshadow tutorial and my thoughts on it, then keep on watching. So, um, I've never really used it yet. I've opened it. But it's the 15H Happy Hour. Um, I've done all my makeup except my eyes so far. So I got a clean slate for you guys. So you can uh, really see if it's nice or not. Looks like this. Open it up. There's like this on it. Oh, there's me. <laughs> all the names. Ooh. Ooh. To start off, I'm going to prime my eyelids. And I'm just using this e.l.f. primer. Um, it's really cheap, but it works really well, so, uh, if you're broke like me, then, uh, go get yourself one of these. So, I'm zoomed in. Hey, do you like my face? So, I'm going to be using this color. It's called On the Rocks, and I'm just going to be putting it, oh, she pigmented. I'm just going to put it all over my eyelids as, like, a base to kind of set the primer and then we're going to move into the real intense look. So I'm going to take this color called Mixer and I'm going to put it into my crease starting as a transition shade and we're just going to go all over. And we're going to do it on the other eye too, of course. So now that that's done, I'm going to go in with the color cheers and cheers is right here it's like a orangey brown color it's really pretty man these are freaking pigmented so i'm just gonna go in and just basically go into my crease deepen up the mixer color we put on before um yeah so it looks like that so far they're kind of hard to blend, but that could just be me because, you know, I'm not a makeup artist, but whatever. So we're looking pretty good so far. We're going to go in with 5PM, which is this color here. It's like a dark, kind of a scary um, brown. And I'm just going to go on the outer corners just like this. And just buff it into my crease. Wow. Wow, I need to wax my eyebrows. All right, next step. I'm gonna go in with this brush. It's by Still. It's just a blender blending brush. And I'm gonna take the color Manhattan Fun fact, I've been there once. The only trip I've ever been on is New York. So I'm going to take it and I'm just going to literally like pack it onto the outer corner because I really want to deepen it up and make it look like a freaking great job. They are hard to blend out. Maybe it's my brushes. Maybe it's just me, but I honestly really, really like it. The color Wingman, it's right there. Um, you can see my microphone. Haha, <laughs> that's the color I'm going to go in with. This one is by BH Cosmetics. Don't know what kind of brush it is. It's pointy, but I'm going to take the color Wingman, that purpley color you just saw, and I'm going to like bring it down onto my waterline. But underneath my eye, wow, that looks really cool. But I'm kind of digging it. Okay, I'm going to go in with the color Last Call. It's the very darkest color there is. And I'm just going to go back into the outer corner and kind of just make it dark. Dark AF. I'm going to just really get in there. Take this brush. This one's by... Uh, Something glam, don't really know. I sound like I have no idea what I'm doing and I probably don't, but like, 
This looks so good, like I actually love it. Okay, so I'm gonna take my little sample of the Too Faced Glitter Glue Primer and I'm just gonna put it on my fingers like this and I'm gonna put it on the outer corner and we're gonna put one of the really pretty shimmery colors right there so then we can uh, get to it I'm gonna spray it with some setting spray to make it a little wet okay, we're gonna go with hot spot hot spot is this one right here it's like a champagne color but it has like little flecks of like pink in it Holy crap. So pigmented. Looks cool. Really nice. I'm just going to take a little, little bit of the 5 p.m. color, which is the dark brown, and I'm just going to like connect it underneath my eyes so then it's not super duper red so now that i'm done with that i'm going to curl my lashes and put on some mascara and then i'm going to talk a little bit more about how i feel about the product personally so far i love it um i think that it's a good price i think it was like 15 dollars, which is honestly extremely cheap for an eyeshadow palette especially the quality that you're getting out of it I usually don't buy expensive eyeshadow because I don't have a lot of money all the time. So this is a A1 product for me. Guys, I wish you could see in person how good this looks because I don't know why my camera sucks. It sucks. I'm talking to my microphone. It sucks. You know what's actually true though? You look, okay, I look so stupid until my lashes are on or until my mascara is on. Like every makeup look I do looks so bad until I have it. And I'm like, once I put my mascara on, everything just looks so much better. So for lips, I am just taking the ColourPop um, lip, what are they called again? Liquid lipstick in screenshot screenshot um i don't wear liquid lipsticks because they're awful on me all right so that's the look i guess um let me know what you think about the eyes i think they look super good i love 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 this palette um, the only downside I would say is probably the fact that it is kind of hard to blend out. I don't know why I look like I'm on crack. I love the colors. The colors are perfect. Um, the only thing I think would be a little better is if the colors were easier to blend. Could just be my problem. I don't know. Um, but they're really pigmented. As you can tell, the shimmers are by far like my favorite better than the matte colors I really love them um, my favorite one is definitely gonna be hot spot just saying but yeah if you guys are interested in buying this palette I think you should if you guys want to see any more reviews on any specific products let me know because I can do that I love trying new things out if you guys enjoyed this video and um, maybe make and end up buying this palette and using it on yourself i want to see so send me pictures and stuff because i freaking love that thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video remember to thumbs up if you enjoyed comment suggestions down below and if you're wondering why i keep looking over here it's because my mirror's there like this video and subscribe for more videos and i will see you in my next one love you guys bye